What's up everybody, welcome back to another video by Green 34 Today, we're going to be doing a review on Todd Crash from the 2019 Thunder Hollow series. So, I'm very excited about this guy. Finally have a Thunder Hollow fan in my collection. Very excited. So, without further ado, let's get started. So, Todd is of course a Thailand release. He was released back in March in Singles Case H along with... Andrew Vrooman, Nick Pitire, Metallic, Marilyn, who I'll be reviewing next, and Michael Roder and Mater with the 95 hat. So, a lot of fun stuff in that case. Uh, we're about halfway through the new cars in the case that I have to review. There's, after this, we have Marilyn, then Michael, or Metallic Marilyn, Michael Roder, and then Mater with the hat. But yeah, let's get on with the video. So, of course, we have the Disney Pixar car slanted logo. Some really nice art of Todd on the blurry desert background. He's in the Thunder Hollow series, which has a brown bar and the crazy eight track as the symbol. Three plus Mattel and then the Todd Crash. On the back here we have the picture of the symbol again. And then we have this awesome shot of Miss Fritter ramming into, I believe that's, yeah, Sigler, Bill, and Patty. And it says, it's crazy at night at Thunder Hollow Speedway. And we have Kevin Riven, Motor Turner, Mo Revlin, and Blindspot. All of which are out, and I'll be reviewing Mo in a couple of weeks. And same for Motor. So, Mo and Motor I'll be reviewing in a couple of weeks. We just have a bunch, my camera will focus, a bunch of legal information. So, I will be right back with this guy opened up. So here he is, all out of the package, looking awesome, just like all the other cars I've been reviewing lately. They just, they all look so good. Really do like the models that Mattel's been releasing lately. Um, but yeah, Todd, of course, appears at the Thunder Hollow Speedway. I'm not entirely sure where. He might have been in the stands, or he might have been in that scene where Queen and Cruz are entering Thunder Hollow. You know, it's hard to tell. Um, I don't remember. But he definitely appeared at Thunder Hollow. That's why he's in that series. So, let's get started. He's got some nice blue eyes there with a yellow eyelid. We have this really awesome textured grill. I love it with the headlights there. And look at the rust. The attention to detail on this car is amazing. So good. Got like a silver bumper with a nice happy expression. He's got like all black rims, which a lot of cars don't have in the cars line, which is really interesting. And then, of course, we have the door, and again, why cars in this universe need doors is beyond me. He's got a ton of rust along the sides there. Looks so good. he got his windows on the back bumper here. He doesn't have a license plate, but you can see the handle for the trunk, which is, this is one of the few cars in the universe that I think actually has a trunk. Interesting. He's got red taillights there with a completely gray bumper. And on the side, we have another, like, streak line going across of rust and even more going along. Like, he's he's almost as rusty as Mater. Like, well, not quite, but he is definitely up there for having the most rust on him. And, yeah, he's got, like, this all gray hood there. And sorry for the cuts. I just had to go take care of something. But, yeah, he's got, like, this opaque back window. And as I mentioned, the gray on the hood and the kind of rust surrounding the trunk. And even on the back of the trunk is really cool. Again, he's got nice mirrors on both sides. But look at the rust in the center. That just looks so good and so well done. Like, wow. I love the attention to detail they put on this car. Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me. Well, I wonder what this thing is. It's like a round patch of rust. It's weird. Very, very nice. Very nice car. Definitely one of my favorites that I've reviewed so far in the recent weeks. On the base here, Disney Pixar, and then made in Thailand with the date stamp M04A. So he was made, I think, the last week of January. That's like the last week of January, I believe. Yeah, and then he's got this whole thing, which 
Again, still don't know why cars have that. Don't know what it's for. And yeah, this car actually has a date stamp, because Nick Pitt Tire, who I reviewed last, he didn't have a date stamp. Weird. You can see on the inside how it's painted like the same color on the inside. That's interesting. But yeah, that's going to be it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know in the comment section below which is your favorite Thunder Hollow fam release so far. Mine, in terms of the ones I've opened, Todd is of course the only one I've opened, so he looks really good. But I think I'm going to like Motor Turner better once I open her up. But we'll have to wait and see. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in a couple of days from my review on Metallic Maryland.